On Sunday night, the New England Patriots ground and pounded their way to a 13-3 victory over the LA Rams in what's being called the most boring Super Bowl in history. And it's not even snoozeworthy Maroon 5 halftime show that earned the game that dubious distinction. Perhaps like the rest of the world, Ben realized that a Pats victory was basically a foregone conclusion. And since Affleck is newly sober, he might not have felt like getting doused in Sam Adams by a bunch of celebratory mass holes. Of course, the fact that he's kicked the sauce isn't the only major change in Affleck's life in recent months. According to E! News, Ben is back together with SNL producer Lindsay Shukas. As you may recall, Ben and Lindsay began dating back in 2017. The relationship got so serious so fast that there were rumors Ben and Lindsay were engaged. A source tells E! That Ben and Lindsay have been on and off for longer than anyone realizes, so maybe there was some truth to those rumors that he started dating Lindsay while he was still married to Jennifer Garner, and they've never been able to quit one another for very long. They've known each other for years and there have been other periods of time where they didn't speak. But they always seem to end up talking again. Ben and Lindsay broke up last year, allegedly because his drinking had once again spiraled out of control. Now, however, it seems they're right back where they started, well, sort of. The insider claims that while Ben and Lindsay are spending time together, which almost certainly means hooking up, but they're not ready to make their relationship official again just yet. It seems Affleck feels that things are going well for him for the first time in quite some time, and he doesn't want to rock the boat with any major announcements. Ben is in a really good place right now. Both health-wise and with his family, another source tells E! News. Ben has been concentrating on being a doting father and has been spending time with his kids and Jen. Affleck is so focused on his recovery and his family that he's reportedly stepped away from his role as Batman in the DC Cinematic Universe. So perhaps Ben's new focus on stability explains why he decided to steer clear of Atlanta during Super Bowl week. Or maybe grown adult and long-suffering Buffalo Bills fan Lindsay just didn't want to run the risk of having to watch Ben fall off the wagon and lock lips with Tom Brady, a la Bob Kraft. As far as we know, lifelong Pats fan Ben Affleck was not in attendance at the game, but it's not entirely clear why Beantown Benny decided to sit this one out.